Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Blessed is the kingdom of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost, now and forever, and world without end. Amen. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. the whole world, for the stability of the Holy Church of God, and for the union of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this Holy Church, and for them that in faith, reverence, and the fear of God enter therein, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the Holy Father Francis, for the Bishop Martin, for the Honourable Order of Priesthood, for the Diaconate in Christ, for the whole clergy and people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For President Michael D. Higgins, for this country, 
for all those in seats of authority and for all the people let us praise the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the Sovereign Lady, Queen Elizabeth and all the royal family let us praise the Lord. Lord have mercy. For our respective countries and for all their people, whether dwelling at home or now scattered abroad, and for their salvation let us praise the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this city, and for all cities and countries, and for them that in faith dwell therein, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For temperate weather, abundance of fruits of the earth, and for times of peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For them that travel by land, by air, or by water, for the sick and the suffering, for prisoners and captives, and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For our deliverance from all affliction, strife, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Protect us, save us, have mercy upon us, and preserve us, O God, by thy grace. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady, Mary, ever Virgin and Mother of God with all the saints, we command ourselves and one another and our whole life unto Christ our God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For all glory, honour and worship befits Thee, Father, Son and Holy Ghost, now and forever and world without end. Amen. Thank mm -hmm. you.
gloria in excelsis Deo. Sacrifice to any God except the Lord. 
This is the word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. The responsorial psalm. The response is, The Lord has shown his salvation to the nations. The Lord, the Lord has shown, shown his, his salvation, salvation to the nations. the nations. The Lord has shown his salvation to the nations. Sing a new song to the Lord, for he has worked wonders. His right hand and his holy arm have brought salvation. The Lord has brought salvation to the nations. The Lord has made known his salvation, has shown his justice to the nations. He has remembered his truth and love for the house of Israel. The Lord has brought salvation to the nations. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God. Shout to the Lord, all the earth. Ring out your joy. The Lord has brought salvation to the nations. Second reading. A reading from the second letter of St. Paul to Timothy. Remember the good news that I carry. Jesus Christ, risen from the dead, sprung from the race of David. It is on account of this that I have my own hardships to bear, even to being chained like a criminal, but they cannot chain up God's news. So I bear it all for the sake of those who are chosen, so that in the end they may have the salvation that is in Christ Jesus and the eternal glory that comes with it. Here is a saying that you can rely on. If we have died with him, then we shall live with him. If we hold firm, then we shall reign with him. If we disown him, then he will disown us. We may be unfaithful, but he is always faithful, for he cannot disown his own self. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Veni Sante Spiritus, et Felice Celitus, Lucis Tua Eradinus. Veni Pater Pauperum, Veni Doctor Oh, 
sheep fold, saith the Lord. He who enters by this door shall be saved and shall find pasture. Alleluia. So here we have a story of ten lepers and of Jesus on the road from Galilee to Jerusalem. And when we find Jesus travelling to Jerusalem in the Gospel, it has a symbolic meaning always. He is on the road to meet his fate. In Jerusalem and the road takes Jesus and his disciples through Samaria <coughs> the lepers were in a leper colony of ten leprosy <coughs> um, as far as I understand is a skin complaint and neurological and it develops into a horrible appearance. The people afflicted before drugs were banished into a leper colony and there they were utterly, utterly lonely and rejected. No family nor friends were allowed to visit them. Only the company of their fellow sufferers And death would have often been welcome. And still, it is not a fatal disease. But many of them would have resorted to suicide to end their misery. The prayer of Job might come to mind. For my sighs come even before I eat. My groans are poured out like water. And then into this wretched, wretched world comes Jesus. The Gospel tells us the lepers saw him and stood afar off as they were required to do. And they raised a cry. They raised their voice, raised a shout. In Greek, Jesu epistata meaning Jesus Epistata was the one who stood by you in the battle line in the thick of it all or the one who watched your rear guard Jesu Epistata a bitter cry it echoes the cry of the blind man in the Gospel, Bartimaeus was his name. And when he heard, because he was blind, he could only hear, that Jesus of Nazareth was passing by, he, he shouted out too. And the people said to him to be quiet, but he would not be silenced, because he was so desperate. This shout and cry of desperation comes from the depths of the being and as the writer Father Anthony 
Metropolitan Antony pointed out this short cry is the perfect prayer hardly more than help Jesus it's called Iesu in the Greek E-A-S-U the E as Stefan pointed out is the screech of pain E sound E changing that to A which is the sound of supplication or begging and again Father Anthony pointed out that the A for the Greeks was the sound of the olive reminding us he said of the olive branch that was brought to Noah in the ark a sign that God's mercy was replacing God's wrath anyway E Esu eleison. That sound again. Eleison. Have mercy. This short cry reminds us too, possibly, of the cloud of unknowing, that great English mystical writer who advocated a short prayer she said, I think it was a she she said, your prayer is to be like a narrow that is able to pierce the cloud of unknowing and reach the place of the mercy of God. So, I'm reminded too, in their desperation, of the great prophet, one of the greatest prophets, Elijah. He, he fell foul of Queen Jezebel, and he had to flee for his life. He was brought low and he lay down to sleep and his, his prayer was to the Lord, take my life, O Lord, and finished, for I'm no better than my father. So I think this prayer of the poor unfortunates with leprosy seems to me to be like the very visceral, very gut-level cry from the depths. Yes, do at the stata. Eleison henas. There's the Greek and English. Lord Jesus Christ Son of the God who lives, have mercy on me, the sinner. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Salve Regina, Mater Misericordiae, Vita Duce, O Estes Nostra Salve. Arte clamus, Exules Filiae. Arte suspiramus, Gemete Deflente.
By the union of this water and wine, may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, who humbled himself, share in our humanity. Munda cormeum ac labia mea omnipotent Deus. Barakata Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Blessed are you, O Lord our God of hosts, King of the universe, by your bounty we have these gifts to offer, bread and wine, Fruit of the earth, fruit of the vine, and work of human hands, they will become our spiritual food and drink. Blessed be God forever. Dominus vobiscu. Et cum spiritu tuo, dursum corda, avemus adomino, gratias agamus domino Deo nostro. Contristat 
certo moriendi conditio, eos dem console tur future, immortalitatis promissio. Tuis en infidelibus domine, vita mutatur, non tolitur. Et dissoluta terrestris huius incolatus domo, eterna in celis habitatio amparatur. Et ideo cum angelis et archangelis, cum tronis et dominationibus, cumque omni militia celestis exercitus, hymnum gloriae tui canimus, sine fine dicentes, Sanctus, Sanctus, Sanctus Dominus Deus Sabao, Plenisum Celia Terra, Gloria Tua, Hosanna. Vobis et promultis 
et funde tu in remission peccatorum. Mysterium Fidei Bring them and all the departed into the light of your Have mercy on us all. Make us worthy to share eternal life with Mary, the Virgin Mother of God, with the Apostles, the Martyrs, St. Nicholas of Mara. Patrick and all the saints, may we praise you in union with them and give your glory to you. Her ipso met cum ipso et in ipso est tibi deo patio mi potenti in unitate spiritu sancti omnis honor et gloria. Per omnia secula seculorum. Amen. 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 And on song is our joy. Thank you. 
You stay, we told you, body of our Lord Jesus Christ. Keep your soul unto life eternal. Amen.
Keep your soul unto life eternal. Amen. blood of our Lord Jesus Christ keep your soul unto life eternal. Amen. blood of our Lord Jesus Christ, keep your soul unto life eternal. Amen. Oh, oh, oh. 
animabus favororum favorarum quetuarum, remissiorum cunctorum tribue peccatorum, ut indulgentiam quam semper opta verut, fi supplicationibus consequantur, qui vivis et regnas, in secula seculorum. Amen. Dominus vobiscum. Et cum spiritu tuo. Eula gesai securios cae fulaxai se. Epiphanae, curios to prosopo notu epise, cae eleisae se, epharae, curios to prosopo notu epise, cae duesoi aerene. Amen. The Lord bless thee and keep thee, the Lord make his face shine upon thee, and be gracious unto thee. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon thee, and bring thee peace. Amen. Benedicat vos omnipotens Deus, Pater et Filius et Spiritus Sanctus. Eat it.